Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, we will show you a game between Daniel Sam Season and Niels Grandilius. This is a game from Swedish Championship 2009. Daniel Sam Season had white pieces and he started with c4, going for the English opening. Maybe. Grandilius played knight to f6, knight to c3, e6, knight to f3 d5, e3, c5, d4. The game has transposed to the semi tarash opening. Knight to c6, d takes on c5, bishop takes on c5, a3 intending b4 and bishop to b2. Grandilius castled kingside. Sometimes players with the black pieces play a5, preventing b4. We have a castling kingside, b4 attacking the bishop, bishop to d6, bishop to b2, knight to e5, white to move, how would you continue now? Black is threatening, knight takes pawn on c4. Daniel same season played knight to b5, black to move, a knight takes on f3 check. If knight takes on c4 as planned, then bishop takes on c4. And after d takes on c4, white wins a piece. Back to our game. Knight takes on f3 check. Queen takes knight. Bishop to e7. C takes on d5. E takes on d5. If knight takes on d5, e4. And after knight to f6, rook to d1. So we have e takes on d5. Bishop to d3. Note how white bishops are aiming at the black king. Bishop to g4 attacking the queen, queen to f4, a6 attacking the knight. What is the best square for the knight? What would you do? Sam season didn't move the knight. He played h3. Bishop to h5. If a takes on b5, h takes on g4. And black king would be in trouble. So we have bishop to h5, knight to d4, bishop to d6 attacking the queen, queen to h4, black to move, bishop to g6 was played, you bishop to e7, then knight to f5. So we have bishop to g6, knight to f5, black to move, knight to e4 was played, you bishop takes on f5, Bishop takes on f5, and after h6, because white is threatening, bishop takes on f6, queen takes on h7, checkmate. After h6, bishop takes on f6, queen takes on f6, queen takes on f6, pawn takes queen, castling queen side, and this endgame would five a white. Back to our game. Grandilius played knight to e4, offering to exchange queens and threatening bishop takes on f5. How would you solve this problem? What would you do? Is white in trouble? Please pause and find the best move for white. Finding the solution in this position will make you very happy. So, please try. Did you pause? What did you find? Daniel some season played this Absolutely amazing move. Queen to h6. The move was so powerful that the player with the black pieces, Grandilius, resigned. White is threatening, queen takes on g7, checkmate. If pawn takes queen, then knight takes on h6, checkmate. And what else? If bishop takes knight, then queen takes on g7, check, mate. So, the killer move was queen to h6. What a move. What do you think of this move? What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.